Okay, I'm having one of those days where Zsa Zsa's going to be right up under my feet. So come on, girl. Let's go outside. It's gorgeous. We had drizzly rain all day yesterday. Or not all day, but a lot of it. Come on, gorgeousness. Okay. And I'm hoping now... Ah, I feel misty rain still. So everything is nice and juicy. So let's just walk around. But you can see, instead of trying to drag pine straw and, and mulch in here, I'm just going to keep layering the boxes and just keep it this side up so it kind of has a uniform look. I know it doesn't look great, but over time what's going to happen is I'm going to build up a good base of boxes. And I think I'm just going to leave it like that for a while because that seems to be working and that's the easiest. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to start trying to build some beds out. And I noticed something on my videos. I had planted around the comfrey some seeds to kind of be the mother plant. And then I forgot to cut to cut the comfrey back so the seeds could get hey, sun and grow. I am over at the standard plum side of the food forest where the wind chimes are. So you can see where I've been laying a lot of boxes down. We have finally had rain. Things are cooling down. It's the end of garden season. I haven't got much to show for it, except that I've done hay sugar strategic planting. Now on my list is pruning, pruning, pruning. What will remain on my list is boxes, boxes, boxes. See, this little stuff right there needs to get covered up with more boxes. And that's how I'm gonna do it. I almost broke down and sprayed. And then I got a hold of and some of these tree guards, the tree rings, and those have helped. So, so I've tamed it a little bit this year. Um, it, I can't be in a constant weed battle. But look, I've got green. I know it's just comfrey, but that comfrey is going to come in handy next year. And it's the Bach 14, the Russian Bach 14. <gasps> Let me keep walking through here. Look at everything. I took some pictures. I think everything is gorgeous. my goodness oh my goodness you make all kinds of noise Jaja. okay okay it's September I can feel autumn blowing in I hear you Jaja girl I hear you Jaja girl I hear you Come on, come on, come on. You don't have to make a big scene about it. Come on, come on. You're just gonna sit there and carry on. Oh gosh, I'm having a kitty cat problem. Come on, well come on. Oh gosh, well she didn't have a clear path to jump. Okay, all right. But there's the food forest. The, probably one of the last glimpses of it. I think that's the right time. But look over here. Oh gosh, it is nippy chilly. Um, let's see. Let me come over here. Look, I cleaned up. Oh gosh, they're eating my, every, oh gosh, they're on my sunflowers. I don't get any, my, I won't talk about it. 
the wildlife is getting everything I plant, it seems. But I'm going to figure that out later. <clears throat> oh, gosh, what are you? Here come some flowers. I wonder, are you the pink, crispy sunchoke? I think that's the kind that went missing in action. And now, it I mean, look how long you are. I'm scared and terrified because I did not plant you here. You're at least 10 feet tall. Look at you. Goodness. Okay, let me keep walking. That's huge. That is look so at all huge. these seeds. So this is the girl. That's the girl plant because of all the seeds, I suppose. See the berries in there? So now I know which that's my girl. And these are my boys. Gosh, I got them separated. Oh, man. Okay. So I've got a lot of boys and then my girl. I guess that's good.